I don't know where to go to no picnic. It brings back too much memories. Early September. I know all the parents think that I miss you so much. I want to have a no problem in my yard with the picnic. Them. Because the morning time when I stand in my schoolyard there, so I miss the parents come drop off them picnic. I want them to have violence in my yard. Mr. Picnic passed me with suitcase. Good morning, sir. Mr. Dana, where this I want to go? I don't know if the government really understand what they're doing, but I believe that the Ministry of Education now have a clue where they do. In primary school, when we were grew up, our teachers used to murder we. We no born in a luxury, we don't have rights. The rights so we did have a fit ball when we were at school. So now, things and time change. I remember my primary school teacher in grade 3 gave me a lick across my back every now and then me feel it. <laughs> For a silly reason, you know, primary school teachers used to get extra lunch on Fridays. And when they come in the class, they got right is kick in and then drop asleep. <laughs> they always put a mat on the board when nobody in the class don't know. And send you up one by one to go work it out. And if you make no mistake, you get a slap. Now that particular day, she put LCM on the board. And send me up there to go work it out. When me go, me get it wrong. And she hit me. One month ago before school break, my nephew come home from school. Me said the minister no know what them do. The boy you do homework and me pass and peep in my book. Mathematics. And me look at the instruction. Find the LCM for the following. Me say lock up a book. <laughs> if it lasts for so long and then can't find it, you not go find it. Shut it up, shut it up. And I am a very outspoken person, you see? And I remember when I hit primary school in grade one, the teacher around me out so I didn't have no manners. Me just outspoken. Now we know that a teacher go to college for five or four years go study and come back to teach we. We, we know so them know everything. So the first day I was in my class, grade one, the teacher run me out. She go college and come back know everything. She go up to the board and write a word on it. And then she turn round and of all the person in the class and me, she pine pan. I said, boy, what is this word? Me say, if you go college and you know what me, I go know. <laughs> so she run me out so I have no manners. <laughs> and then I believe now, say, teaching is good thing, so me say, I'm going to get into it. And right now I'm a teacher and I'm the kindest teacher in Jamaica. Was. <laughs> Anytime me I go to school those days, me not pass any of my students as long as I have space I pick them up. I cut it out. I don't care one more in there. <laughs> one evening I was going through the gate, heavy rain coming down. I saw five students standing there. Me know them I go wait up. So me with my kind self stop. Me say four you come. All five of them come inside. I say I cannot carry all five of you, somebody will have to go. Nobody move them sit down, see me for feed them vehicle. <laughs> me say somebody have to go. Nobody move them sit, see me. I say, you know what? The ugliest person, please leave. Nobody move them sit down, same way. More than a little girl on the front touch me, I say, then who are going to drive? 